Hello guys, welcome once again. In the last few videos, we have been seeing how to uh, generate a PDF and enter uh, the data such as images, list, paragraph or tables or graph from your C Sharp application to your PDF file using iText Sharp and C Sharp application. Um, and till now, what we are doing is we are just pressing this button and it generates our PDF file in the debug folder of our project. Okay but what if I want to see the PDF file directly and I don't want to go to my debug folder again and again and I, I should open the test.pdf file again and again I just want to open uh, the file once I created uh, the file so when I click this button my file should open also at the same time by clicking this button so how can I achieve this in this video I will show you because it's a bit uh, irritating going to your debug folder and see the PDF file so let's see uh, how we can achieve uh, that goal to open the file directly and not going to the folder so just click this create PDF and double click it and this is the code I have been showing you in the last four or five videos okay to create the PDF and to create the content in the PDF so in this code just go at the bottom where your document dot close um, code is there okay so up to this code our document is created the PDF is already created and before the closing of the method or the function closing just right here after this document dot close we need to open the PDF file so we will write the code for opening the PDF file so just write system dot diagnostic dot process dot start and bracket and bracket closed okay and in this uh, start bracket we are going to pass the path of uh, the text file so I will just right click it and go to the property and I will just copy the path of this PDF file okay close the properties and I will in the double quotes I will paste the path and it will show error because we need to add double slashes instead of single slashes and okay so in the start uh, bracket just pass the path of your PDF and now when you run the program so username and password and when I click this my PDF should open directly so I click create PDF and you can see the PDF is opened directly and I don't need to go to the folder and open it so by using this code you can open the PDF directly but one more thing if you have your file wherever your exe file is there executable file is there and you are generating your uh, pdf file in your debug folder or your release folder of your project where your uh, application file is there so type application 
and your debug folder then you don't need to provide this long path you just give the name of this PDF file so this code is now very short so system dot diagnostic dot process dot start and in the bracket in the double quotes just give the name of the PDF file it will also work perfectly fine so let's try and run the program once again and once I click it, click this, my PDF should open. So I click this and the PDF is open once again. So in this way you can launch the PDF directly after the creation of the PDF. So I hope this will help in your programming. And please rate, comment and subscribe and bye for now.